Next question is from Dan Cohen Solal. Is it healthy to have a protein shake every day? Any long-term health issues with that? Yeah, this, so I'll tell you guys a story. This reminds me. So I have, uh, you know, I have a lot of cousins, and we're all right around the same age. We all grew up together, and I've always been into working out. So they would always ask me questions about that. And I remember one of my cousins was trying to lose weight, and he, you know, and because he'd asked me questions so many times, I think he was like, "I'm not going to ask Sal. I'm going to do some stuff and then see what I can do." Right? Anyway, he comes to me, and he's like, "Dude, Sal, I'm I'm gaining uh, body fat. I'm trying to get lean." But I keep gaining body fat. I don't know what the hell's going on. I'm like, well, let's let's talk about your diet or whatever. And he's like, yeah. So I'm eating this, that, and the other. And he goes, and it doesn't make any sense. I take a I take two shakes every day, and I'm still getting fatter. I'm like, well, it's, it's all extra calories, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's calories. So, so my point with the story is that uh, are protein shakes okay every day? It really depends. Mm-hmm. Are if it's throwing your calories over, then you're going to gain body fat. Um, is it helping you hit your protein requirements and your calories are good? Then it's going to be great for you. Protein shakes are a tool. They can be used in ways that are good, and they can be used in ways uh, that are not so good. Um, it all depends on your diet. It depends yeah. on your goals. And the quality of the protein. That's uh, another powder, piece too. Yeah, it's like it's interesting because like the common knowledge is that protein shakes or bars are health foods. Uh, it, you know, and like we've talked about this and like a lot of them are like super processed and, you know, have a lot of different sugars and sugar alcohols that they put in them. And so it's, you know, not all of them are equal. And and also like nothing's going to beat just whole foods. And so this is why we stress that first and foremost. And then if, you know, your protein levels aren't where they should be, like this is where we introduce that to complement it. But it's complementary. It's not like a main food group. Yeah, I feel like this is very similar to this, the super set question right before this. I feel like I, my goal is to always get all my foods through whole or all my calories through whole foods. The reality is that doesn't happen a lot of times. And when I have to, or when I'm low, I always do my shakes after at the end of the day. That's just always how I eat it. It's like, I look back at my day and I go, and that helps you dictate how much. Yeah. And that's, that's dictates if I'm going to take it or not, I go through my head and I go, and, and here's the thing. If I, like, let's say my, my protein intake for me is about 200 grams, right? If I land at like 170, I'm actually still not taking a shake. You know where I'm taking a shake? is, the, And this happens when I have like 70 grams of protein for the day. You know, there's a day, there's easily a day where two of the meals were good-sized protein meals for me, but then maybe the other one or two were very carb-heavy and I didn't get hardly any or no protein in it whatsoever. And I'm sitting at the end of my night right now going, okay... What do you do? What do you want, Mozzie? He doesn't like your what do you, answer. What do you want? <laughs> <He's> like, <laughs> this is and bullshit. I'm looking at the I'm looking at the end of the night. What's he mad at? What's that all about? He's the, he's the lie detector dog. He's like, I don't know, Adam. You be taking <laughs> shakes. He's like, all day you, long. Be, you drink a lot of shakes. Yeah, yeah. What's yeah. that all about, guy? Yeah. Bad dream or what? Huh? <laughs> out of nowhere. What you? What went out there, Doug? Was there someone out there? I didn't see anything. Oh, he just went all pissed yeah. off right there. No, so I, I'm using it if and only if. I'm not getting adequate protein, but and my goal is always to try and do it through whole foods. So, and if I catch myself, which happens, using a protein shake every single day for a few weeks in a row, that's kind of like I have, you know, the come to Jesus talk with myself and go like, okay, I could be better about making, you know, preparing my foods and making better choices so I don't have to use this all the time. 